If you watch our show with any regularity, you probably know that I love a good prank, and I especially, there's no one I love to pull them on more than my Aunt Chippy, who lives here in Las Vegas. Let's bring Aunt Chippy out. Aunt Chippy. Look at this. Aunt Chippy, please. Stand on the stage together. Hello. Say hello to everyone, Aunt Chippy. Hi, everybody. So, Aunt Chippy. How many years have you lived here in Las Vegas? 43. 43 years. Uh, Aunt Chippy's hobbies include video poker, smoking, and yelling at people, right? Especially you. So I've been doing stuff to Aunt Chippy since I was a kid, since I was a child. I used to put little explosives in her cigarettes, and the cigarettes would explode. I'd, on occasion, I've sent crazy letters pretending they were from other members of our family, which always makes you mad. I um, would crank call you at work all the time. In a way, you are my muse. And what? then I got a television show. And then the limit, the ceiling went way, way up. I found out you'd never seen a sonogram before. Uh, so my cousin Sal and I colluded with Aunt Chippy's daughter, my cousin Mickey, who was pregnant at the time with your grandson, to stage a fake sonogram. And well, take a look at this. <laughs> You believe that, for real? Of course I believe this. <laughs> Why wouldn't I believe it? I'm so excited. I'm going to see a sonogram for the first time in my life. Uh -huh. And it's my grandchild. Yeah, and it's doing jumping jacks. And it's doing jumping jacks, and it's clapping its hands, and it's picking its nose. It's doing a little disgusting yeah. thing. But we think we figured that out. And once when you were at work, I sent a crew over to paint your house orange and green. Do you remember that? Very well. well. In case you don't, we have a clip of that, too. What's going on? You don't paint my house, this. Stop painting. Stop. Get your truck off my lawn. No, stop it. No, was that one your favorite of all the pranks? Was that the best it one? It was your favorite. I know oh, that. I like that anyway, I know you've been expecting something. She's been all week like, what are you going to do to me? What are you going to do to me? Well, guess what? It's April Fool's Day, but I'm not going to do anything to you because it would be too obvious to do something to you on April Fool's Day. And in fact, I'm going to do the opposite. I know you have a crappy car. I know you have the plastic taped up on your car. So what I'm going to do tonight to maybe, I don't know, make amends for the many pranks is I'm going to give you a brand new Mazda CX-3 tonight. A car. It's a car. I promise. Hold it. Hold it. Does it have a motor? It has a motor. It is brand new. Does it new. have tires? It is a beautiful car. In fact, let's go, let's see it right now. It is, uh, well, that's your house. It's supposed to be out front of your house. Where is the car? Where is I'm Sal? My house is still there. OK, there's cousin Sal. Hey, Sal. Hey, Jimmy. OK, so that's his Aunt Chippy's house. <laughs> Aunt Chippy, you really should lock up. It's too easy to get in the house. So Sal's in the house. This is your actual house. Just uh, confirm that for everyone. Yes, it is my kitchen. <laughs> Show us around a little bit, Sal. I'm scaring the crap out of me. <laughs> well, we have all sorts of awards and uh, proverbs on the wall here. I don't uh -huh. know if you can catch it. There's uh -huh. a lot going on. Uh, there's the refrigerator. She's got every Christmas card since 1976. Um, oh. Boy, the first time I was on the David Letterman show was like 1998 or something. And I showed a picture of a jack-o'-lantern that my grandfather carved. He put it in the freezer to save it for the next year. And yes. so it was in the freezer for a whole year. That was more than 20 years ago. Is it in there? Well, no, there's no way it's still in here. That would, whoa, look at oh, that. Oh, yeah, there it is. In. <laughs> Go into that Grandpa Sal's good. room. <laughs> OK. That's 20 terrifying. Years. 20 way, years that has been in there. I don't know if you guys have eaten, but this is either a beef stroganoff or a brownie. So, <laughs> you want? All right, we'll do it that later. You always were a great cook, Aunt Chip. Yes. Yeah. Let's go back. All right, come with me. Yeah, this is our grandfather's room. He's deceased. 
Uh, he was killed by beef stroganoff, but um, <laughs> you can see. Grandpa that. used to uh, paint on beer cans, and there's Sammy Davis Jr. Uh -huh. um, he took his talents then to eggshells. I don't know if you could see, <laughs> but he would paint on eggshells. That, I think, is Aunt Chippy right there. Uh -huh. um, that's uh, either, uh, I, don't, I think that's Elton John, Saddam Hussein. He really got everybody. Yeah. And then he, then he would go to uh, eyeglass frames, right? I don't even know. <laughs> no, they're eyeglass <laughs> lenses. Yeah. Oh, lenses, right. I'm yeah. sorry. Uh, there's Tark. You talked about Jerry Tarkanian eating a towel. There yeah, we right can't there. really see him, but. So, no. well, you know what, Sal? What about the car, though? We forgot about the car. Oh, the car, yeah. Oh, yeah, hold yeah. on. Follow me. We were going to put the show car a in the picture of you. Yeah, there is a big picture painting of me. It's big. Yeah. We we're going to put the car in the driveway. Well, we figured that's stupid. So right. we let it right in here in the living room. I can't hear you. Yeah, oh, you mean you I... You're a moron, you two! I'm hearing you say, what is wrong with you? I'm not hearing thank you for the car at all. In my living room? <laughs> well, where else are we supposed to put it? You know, I'm not gonna... I only got a couple of months till I get to 80. <laughs> I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make it. Not with these two in the family. Well, you're gonna make it in style in a brand new Mazda CX-3. <laughs> and for real, leather seats, a six-speed automatic transmission, and it's right there in your living room. The drive, take it anywhere you want. Take it into the kitchen, take it for a spin in the backyard. <laughs> Sal, be careful. I'm careful. Oh, she's Sal, kidding, but Sal. look. Sal, please do not. Sal, do not knock the house down. Oh, he can't hear me. Well, anything you want to say, Aunt Chippy? Get him out of my car. <laughs> there you go. Happy April Fool's Day to you. Hi, I'm Jimmy Kimmel. If you want to see all our latest videos, click the subscribe button. And if you don't, click anyway and close your eyes when they come on.